Michael Bowden back here once again. And I am your host, Destiny Hero Mike, baby. And welcome back to the time. And I'm sure you guys can tell, you know, by my tempo and my uh, just everything, the vibe and everything, even just that intro there. Things are finally starting to get better. Things are finally starting to look up. And I, first and foremost, I just want to thank you guys so much for all your help. I really appreciate you guys. I'm going to be getting back on my feet, I believe, sooner than later now. Things are really looking up. Things that I've been working on, it, it, it's starting to go through. You know, it's been a kind of a dicey February. But again, uh, you guys came through with so much help. And I appreciate you guys so much. And... Uh, just a, a couple things I do want to want to update you guys on. I know you guys, some of you guys are asking questions if I'm going to come back and uh, and if you know the merch and all that stuff. So first, the merch is the most important thing for me to cover. Um, yes, I'm going to get you guys, you guys' merch, but I'm going to need more time. I mean, I lost Dane here, everything that I had, so it's hard when you're starting all the way over from zero. And bills and rent are still coming and you don't have an income. Very difficult to do those things. But like I said, it's starting to get better. So thank you. I am going to get you guys, you guys, the stuff. But I just need more time. I'm going to be real with that. I'm, I need more time. So I appreciate you guys so much on that. And another thing I do want to be 100% open and clear on that I, I get because... Uh, you know, I haven't really had much of a chance to really address, really, because this is my Yu-Gi-Oh! channel, so I don't really talk about, uh, you know, other than obviously what's going on, it's the elephant in the room, you, you know, you know, lose all your belongings in your home and everything like that, and your your source of income, you gotta, you gotta talk about that, you gotta come clean on, every, on any avenue that you might be on, but one thing I do want to address, the murmurs of... My, I have an old company. I've mentioned this before, too, if you're a, a, a fan of the channel. Left Side 91. That was my original uh, clothing brand uh, years ago. And I haven't really had the chance to tell my story about that. It was my first company. It was an anime-inspired um, It was an anime -inspired clothing brand. Uh, it was one of the first of its kind. I launched it back in 2017. And it ran up until, I think, 2020, I think. Things were going fine. I had, so long story short, uh, I had some business partners. I ran it on my own for the first uh, four years, or three and a half years. Had some business partners during the end. We, we were doing pretty good. The, the, their first two years, we were, we were doing good. And what actually happened when things really started getting tough, we weren't able to get those orders out. And, well, I wouldn't say that. Just things got tough where, you know, we got into a jam. Things weren't so profitable. They left. And they left me holding the bag. Not only that, they also took everything that I taught them. All of my trade secrets. And they turned it in. They, they, they used... Uh, they started their own company, leaving me holding the bag and me being the face of the company. I'm going to take all the brunt of it and I'm not, I'm not going to be able to fill orders and stuff like that. And it got too big for me to handle and it, the, the bubble just busted and I was left holding the bag. And that's how I got did. And now their company is profitable and it was thriving and they ripped off all of my designs um, uh, quite a bit when they first started. I can't for legal reasons. I, I'm not going to name who they are. But yeah, you know, if you're watching, you know who you are. They did me dirty, and 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 it had been like that ever since. And I never really had the chance to actually openly defend myself. And I, I say that because I have some detractors in my. I don't call them. Maybe they were once supporters of mine, but now they are detractors for obvious reasons. You know, they would they they probably probably made a purchase and. They got burnt through that process or, you know, or they've been following, you know, left side 91 and are upset 
as a third party, even if they didn't purchase anything or upset at me. But that's the truth. That's the honest to God truth. That's what happened. And sometimes in business, it just goes bad where you're not able to fill. Your, it's just it just goes bad. You get called all kinds of names when you're the face of a company. And if 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 things go bad as the face of the company, well, one end it's a double edged sword. One end you get all the credit and you look like a genius when everything goes right, but when everything goes wrong, you're a con artist, you're a scammer, you're you know. And if, if, even if it's reasons outside of yourself, uh, and this was during COVID too. This was during COVID, so things just started getting tough, especially the. The manufacturing tolls and all that stuff was just through the roof. And then my partners, again, you know, they bailed on me holding the bag and started their own similar company, similar designs. And yeah, I never had the chance to. So I wanted to also take this chance, you know, because now the people are like, oh, yeah, you're you started left side 91 and now you start D time. And now you're it's the same pattern. You're, you know, just business went bad. And I think if I were to be a criminal, I'd be more intelligent. I wouldn't be the, I wouldn't make myself, make myself the face of anything. And, uh, I certainly would have, uh, my left side 91, um, Instagram page is still up with all the criticisms and everything. No deleted comments, no, no comments were shut down and no deleted pages and no deleted posts, not one with my face all over it. Uh, if I were a criminal, you would think common sense would be smarter to just deactivate the account, right? Right, right. And we don't do that because I plan on returning someday in the future. I don't know when. And future D Hero Mike here. Always understand this as well. Left side ninety one. That was my baby. You know. And all, all, all every, I've worked so hard for that. I've worked so hard for that, you know, I had a big Facebook page taken down, a lot of money went into that, I still have my Instagram page on there, I had almost 20,000 followers, I worked really hard on that, I worked too hard for it to become what it is today, and not only, you know, I apologize to everybody there that I let down, despite everything that, the way it happened. It's always my intention to return to that because there's nothing like it. And I believe there's no other anime, you know, online place that's put out the kind of work that I've put out. Uh, I was the most innovative. So I've worked way too hard. Anybody who's actually followed the journey, you go all the way back to some of the first posts there for it to turn out the way it did. So to anybody who made a purchase... Anybody who made a purchase, anybody who's ever believed in me there, I apologize. I apologize for letting you guys down. Um, but I plan on returning. So it's going to take a lot of time to return and fix that mess. It is a mess. But, you know, I, I, I chose uh, D time because Yu-Gi-Oh saved my life. It saved my life from going to a dark place and doing stupid things. So that's why I turned to D time. It was out of my hands at that point by the time it turned into the way that it did. And that's why I left the pages up. So not so much to my detractors, but if you're anybody who made a purchase and purchase, you know, and, and supported Left Side 91 at any point in time, my apologize to you guys. Not my detractors, but to the people who actually were burned in that process. I apologize. But I wanted to talk about that. I want to be open about that. So yeah, I plan on coming back to tournament. And I, I plan on uh, getting equipment again. And I plan on giving you guys the top, the creme de la creme quality of D-Time as it once was. You browse back to all, all my videos, creme de la creme quality. Plan on getting back to that. And uh, just, again, thank you guys so much. And uh, I would like to ask, of course, if you want to continue helping uh, down in the comments pinned and in the description pinned, you can continue helping. Got a GoFundMe set up. It, would, it will help get me back to where I was just quicker. So um, you don't have to. Just 
Every penny helps. And I appreciate you guys. I love you guys. And as always, catch y'all in the next one.